I'm running out of time, every day goes by so fast And every moment counts, baby, I don't wanna miss a thing We can sleep under the stars, we can sleep under the stars Or hang out in hotel bars, driving somewhere in your car We can sleep under the stars, we can sleep under the stars Under the stars bitten by the travel bug? 2020 has been quite a bitter time for you. The whole year we waited for this pandemic to end. Now that the situation is somewhat under control, I decided to visit this amazing place which is famous for dazzling sublime silken blonde beaches, crystal clear water, serene natural beauty and some of the best diving in South Asia. I thought of recording the whole process but that was not possible because we had too many things to carry. We had to produce a COVID negative report. So that was not possible. As you can see, we have already reached our hotel. And this is our room in Tay's Shemural Dad Port Play. Just got freshened up a little bit. Now I'm going to grab some food because super hungry and after that maybe we will visit, go to visit Sel We are at the dining area. Suresh, 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 Suresh. Meet my friends, Jinna, Hi. Rajiv and also meet my husband. <laughs> The entry at the cellular jail closes at 4 p.m. for the tourists, so we have to finish eating quickly. We are here at the cellular jail or Tala Pani. This place was built by English East India Company as their penalizing colony. This place is called Tala Pani, but neither the soil nor the water is Kala or black here. This name is given because of the ruthlessness or the brutality of the torture that was given to the convicts. A sentence of deportation to Kala Pani meant throwing the prisoner in a living hell because the work quotas given to these prisoners were impossible to complete within the time limit. Those who failed to complete the work were given inhuman punishments. The saga of the lion-hearted freedom fighters and their struggle is brought alive in a moving Sony Lumiere daily inside the jail compound. Today is the second day at Andaman. Yesterday was quite a hectic day. We visited the cellular jail and was a light and sound show which was quite a thrilling experience as we got to know about the history of the place. And today we are heading towards Havelock Islands. We are at the ferry ghat. We are about to take the ferry. The prime transportation here for the local people as well is the uh, water transportation. So the queue has already started. Okay, so here we have to again show our COVID test report. And they will allow us to enter the cruise only if we are COVID negative. This is basically a private ferry. So it is fully covered. If you book the government ferry, you will get the chance to enjoy the view from the deck. Maybe while returning, we will try that. It will take nearly two hours to reach from Port Blair to Havelock. As we all know, Andaman Nicobar consists of more than 300 islands. So we have reached here in Havelock Island. This island was named after the British General Sir Henry Havelock. Later, in the year 2018, uh, our Prime Minister Narendra Modi renamed this island as Swarajji and added to be as Shahidi and Netaji Shubhas Chandra Bodhi was done as a tribute uh, to Netaji Shubhas Chandra Bodhi. We have reached at our resort which is Heavy's Resort at Havelock Island. This, was, this is just two minutes away from the ferry cart. And it was a two hours journey from Port Port Blair to Havelock Island. And now let me give you a quick book tour. Just like Goa, Andaman is best explored in a scooty, but only Jinnah has a two-wheeler driving license, so we are going by a car. We are heading towards Radhanagar Beach. We have come to see the sunset, but we today missed it. 
because we were so late. Early morning in the havelock, we are going for the scuba diving. Come on. Before going for the dive, they will want you to fill up a form uh, where they lift all the liabilities of your life from their shoulder. <laughs> After doing scuba diving, we returned to our hotel and had our breakfast and all of us got ready as we were going to Elephant Beach. You can reach there either by boat or by trekking through the forest. The trek starts near the Radhanagar beach and it takes nearly 30 to 45 minutes to arrive there. We are going by speed boats as the time is less and we want to try out most of the water sports at Hadlock. Elephant Beach is the most popular destination in Hadlock Island for water sports like snorkeling, sea walk, banana boats, glass bottom ride, jet skiing and all of that. Paid changing rooms and lockers where you can keep your precious belongings safely are available at the beach side. Small snacks and fruit shops are also available, but the pricing of the water activities varies highly, so you make sure to negotiate a bit. I'm going to do snorkeling. This is my first water activity ever in life. They have already tried suba, suba trying in the early morning. So they have enjoyed it thoroughly. Let's see how it goes. A thousand miles across the sea. from our hotel at 8 a.m. in the morning then we came here we are at Kalapathar beach this place is beautiful this is not as crowded as Rathanagar beach and Elephanta beach there are some souvenir shop over there uh, you can collect the souvenir Island is at 2 p.m. So we still got one and a half hour. So we thought of grabbing some food because we are quite hungry. So we are at a nice cafe, which is called Big Bite. I have reached here in the resort where we will be staying in Neil Island. Among the three resorts where we have stayed in different three islands, I love this one the most because this has a private pool inside and also a private beach. Come, let's take you to a big room tour. all the checking procedures and we will get freshen up a little bit then we will rush to the sunset point which is at Lakshmanpur beach this is our room cozy and comfy from here you will get the view of the swimming pool
these are the complimentary stuff, the coffee, tea and everything. This is the washroom. to survive Love is low down Don't know how to flow You don't care anymore For a change in your life And you know That I know I gotta feel you Show me the real you You gotta give me All that you got I gotta feel you Show me the real you you gotta give me all that you got, eh? I get motion sickness very often. After the glass boat ride, I was feeling really dizzy, so I took some rest at the beachside and had some nail pani and decided to have a lunch at a beachside cafe. So we are at uh, Beach View Gayatri Restaurant. Also meet our friend from Pune, Ashwini and Suresh. These people are really sweet. Jeetna finally got the chance to roam around in Ashwini's scooty. Since day one, she has been nagging me for it. Now she can die in peace. Next destination, Natural Breach at Lakshmanpur 2. Uh, we have very limited time to spend here as we have our cruise back to Port Blair in the afternoon. Best time to visit the place is during low tide. Only then it is accessible as it is a coral bridge. You can see a variety of tiny fishes and other marine creatures in the shallow water of the beach during the low tide time. Now some tips for you people. Number one, remember to carry enough cash because very few ATMs are available and most of them had no cash. Coordinate the checkout time of the resort and the time of the cruise for another island so that you can utilize the time well. Lastly, carry BSNL SIM if you can. BSNL give the best service here rather than Vodafone or Airtel. That's it. Hope you have enjoyed the vlog. Do not forget to like, comment and subscribe.